was the end of the series. And you had to wait four months till Doctor Who came back again to find out what that Doctor was like. And I think that was brave as well. You know, because that, that first story was not... Uh, well, it was voted the worst story ever, wasn't it? <laughs> well, I don't know... I think you, some of you will know that I have this thing about polls. Why do we have to have things that are best, second best, third... You have your best, yeah. If you've got 13 doctors, you can vote and say, who's your favourite doctor? And one name appears. That's okay. You know, the favourite doctor maybe, possibly even someone like David Tennant, you know. Could, <laughs> could be everyone's favourite doctor. Could be, yeah. <laughs> but why do we have to list it all the way down? And Doctor Who magazine did that for a while. I think they may have stopped. Um, but you, you vote for the writer you like best in the last 10 years. Someone's going to be last if you list all of them. Tell us who's best. Tell us who's the favourite, the one that everybody likes, because the other dozen doctors aren't going to be upset by that. But if you insist on taking them down to the bottom one, that's unkind. That's what, when I was at school, we used to get school reports, and there were 32 in my class, and you could be 32nd in English. You know, because this, schools don't do that anymore because it's not helpful, constructive, supportive. It, it does nothing other than depress people. It doesn't incentivize you to do better. Uh, class positions were uh, awful, we have now realized. So why are we still doing with creative people? You know, you were still very good, but you were the worst. You know, it's, it's just, no, it's not. Uh, I remember getting the twin diner on, on video and I remember watching it over and over again. I thought it was colourful, brash, loud, but very good actually. Um, but hopefully we won't have to see that time again. Hopefully we can, as I say, move on and not have the whole results listed. But there is something you had an involvement with in Doctor Who magazine back in the 1990s.